Let's talk about the difference between DKA versus HHNS. DKA stands for diabetic ketoacidosis, and HHNS stands for hyperglycemic hyperosmolar non-ketotic syndrome. The issue with both of these is hyperglycemia. Now, DKA, usually you see a glucose level of 300 to 500, where in HHNS, it's much higher with the level being 600 or higher. Now for the onset, the onset of DKA is very abrupt, where HHNS is typically more of a gradual onset. DKA happens most commonly in type 1 diabetic patients, and HHNS happens most commonly in those type 2 diabetic patients. Now for metabolic acidosis, will DKA have metabolic acidosis? Well, yes, absolutely. A classic symptom of DKA is acidic breath, also called fruity breath. Now will HHNS have metabolic acidosis? Well, no, there's no acidosis or no ketones present in HHNS. These are some of the core differences between DKA and HHNS. For more information like this, you can find it in the Complete Nursing School Bundle. Happy studying, future nurses.